School children from across New Jersey are spreading the message of the importance of staying drug-free through artwork and drawings. Bert Sempier joins us and reports. Over 6,000 fourth graders from all 21 New Jersey counties recently participated in the 16th annual Partnership for a Drug-Free New Jersey Design a Fourth Grade Folder Contest. The early contest challenges young students to create artwork with the slogan about saying no to drugs. Recently in Newark, 34th grade student finalists presented their artwork to a crowded auditorium inside the Newark Museum. Angelo Valente, the executive director for the Partnership for a Drug-Free New Jersey, says this contest is an important piece in educating young kids about the dangers of and the alternatives to drug use. Well, I think it's crucial because I think that, the, that these kind of uh, messages are really important to start developing life skills. And there's no reason that those life skills shouldn't start at very early ages. And we think this age is at a really crucial age because it's prior to middle school. And we know that at, when the time a child enters middle school, that the rate of drug use and experimentation goes up. So it's important to get these messages at this point. After the 30 finalists showed off their artwork, Nicholas Lewis from Haworth Public School in Bergen County and Leandra Taylor of St. Michael's School in Essex County were named first place winners of the contest. Nicholas described his artwork. Just um, like me in school and then me playing football. The 6,000 students that submitted their artwork for this year's contest set a record for most participants. It allows people who are entering that age group every year to be able to get an opportunity to stand up and say that they believe that drug-free is the way to be. And they also want to share that message with their, with their classmates and with people throughout the state of New Jersey. And the two finalists will have their artwork printed on folders, which will be distributed to every fourth grade class in New Jersey. Reporting in Newark, Bert St. Pierre, WMBC News.